Guided by the tagline, May Pandemya Man O Wala, ang aming paralan ay laging handa. Jadi National High School continues to deliver quality education to its stakeholders amidst the pandemic. Jadi National High School, the hub of excellence and holistic education. As a home to 2,078 students for the school year 2021-2022, We continue to be recognized as one of the best performing schools in the division of Nueva Vizcaya. Modular learning is still in effect for the school year 2021-2022. As such, knowledge bearers continue to deliver and retrieve self-learning modules to the 19 barangays in the municipality on a two-week interval. The latest conduct of delivery and retrieval of self-learning module was done on June 16, 2022. But based on a quarterly survey conducted to the parents and students on the preferred learning modality, face-to-face -face learning ranked first. The possibility of conducting face-to-face -face classes was pointed out when the Department of Education released an interim guidelines on the expansion of limited face-to-face -face classes on February 2, 2022. This was further emphasized by Department Order 17, Series of 2022, entitled Guidelines on the Progressive Expansion of Face-to-Face -face Classes. Through the leadership of Dr. Marilyn B. Magno, Secondary School Principal 4, Jadi National High School immediately responded and prepared the school for face-to-face -face classes. This includes documents and physical setup such as wash areas, signages, classroom setup, and others. The school was validated on May 27, 2022 by division personnel. Jadi National High School was recommended to the regional office for reopening on June 6, 2022, starting with the senior high school classes. Upon the approval of DepEd Regional Office, Jadi National High School reopened and welcomed senior high school students on June 6, 2022. Grade 11 learners were set to attend the first week of their assumption of classes, followed by the grade 12. The following are the best practices of the school. Close monitoring of learners during the conduct of classes. Teachers stay at their own post during the entry and exit of students. Distribution of kits during the opening of classes. Ensures that health protocols are properly implemented both for learners and employees. Conduct of regular disinfection every end of classes. And Ojo on health protocol is played every morning before the start of classes. The following concerns, issues, and gaps were noted. Students who are for far-flung areas came late. They were advised to manage their time in coming to school. Some students did not push through face-to-face -face classes. They were advised to shift back to modular learning. Poor attendance. As a solution, teachers prepare and implement learning recovery plan to students. Working students did not attend classes. To assist these students, interventions and remediations were given online. And sick learners did not attend classes. As a solution, intervention or remediation were given online. To bridge the gap between face-to-face -face and modular learning, the following learning recovery plans were conducted. Tutok kita, reaching out and tutoring of students. Project SAFE, stakeholders assistance for friendly education. A joint effort of stakeholders to improve the academic achievement of students through home visitation and tutoring services. And 7 o'clock to 7.30 habit. Tutoring of learners who has deficiencies before the start of the first period. The pandemic is not yet over, but Jadi National High School always find ways in delivering education to the learners. May pandemya man o wala, ang aming paaralan ay laging handa.